The following video is rated PG-13, which may contain scenes and or themes that are not for people under the age of 13. Jak w porach roku Iwaniego Zmienia się światło w twoich oczach Powiedz mi życie coś miłego Nie pędź tak proszę, daj odpocząć Życie, życie jest nowego Które nigdy nie masz dosyć Białe, białe włosy Życie, życie jest nowelą Raz przyjazdą, a raz wrogą Czasem chcesz się pochwalić Ale nie masz to słowo Come on, I'm going to be late for my meeting. Are you sure you don't need anything on the way to the office, dear? Look, I don't have time for this right now. I'll be fine. Oh, of course, just be safe out there. Okay, thanks. Bye. Whoa, what has gotten into her? Oh, you know, just the usual morning rush. Just scrolling on Instagram as usual. All right, look, you still think about Polly and Hot Bop? Um, yeah, why? Ever since Forex killed your father and your sister, we wanted to have a funeral for them. But for some reason, there never was one. Not even in the past six months. Yeah, that stupid Dottie finance problem has gotten the best of it. Exactly. And we don't have enough money to fund the funeral, which really sucks. Whoa, why don't she just go and talk to Patricia? She knows about what happened. I don't know about that, Sprague, but I'll think about it. We can perhaps scatter Hop Bop and Polly's ashes at the ocean or whatever. Oh god, I'm so sorry I came late. That's okay. You came at a good time. It's great to have you with us, Cindy. So, how long have you been the CEO of the Blooper Center? For about eight months now, I think. When Sonic left as CEO after the whole Forex situation, I was named the CEO so I could try to make the studio boost its economy and its profits. Back in the day, it was once used to be a place for people to watch bloopers, but no one could have predicted that the blooper center is expanding into the market. There is a cafeteria, and an office department, and it is also a residential apartment house where people live, laugh, and love. You once mentioned the explosions in your studio back in February. Forex was responsible, right? Yes. They blew it up in retaliation because of Sonic escaping from the country. He was a major threat to them, but fortunately we managed to wipe the mafia out, or whatever it was. I used to be married to my husband, Orlando, but when he found out that Fan and I had an affair, he divorced me. But since recently, I married to Fan, and we lived happily ever since. Well in that case. We'll continue to discuss the studio's future and perhaps announce further expansions. And in case you want to call us, you'll get our number from the phone book. Sure. Aren't you supposed to be working today? Well, yeah, but I'm currently having a day off right now. I'm waiting for Mordecai. Oh, I see. So, I'm waiting for Mordecai, because we wanted to have a chat about our future. Wait, so are you gonna marry him? I thought the wedding was off. Well, given by the reconciling, maybe it is time we try again and perhaps start a new life together. A better future for both of us. Oh, okay then. I don't know how Lydia will feel about that, but I'll chat to her later. Hi, Scott. Any plans for tonight? Oh, I'm not in the mood right now. I haven't slept last night because of this garbage. Is that a book? Are you writing something? Do I mind checking it out? Don't. You have no right to go through my stuff. This is my business, so go mind one yourself. 
problem. Alf, this is not right. Scott has been acting grumpy all day and I don't know why. I need to talk to him and find out exactly what is going on. Oh, good. You're here. I was hoping if I could talk to you. Can it wait? I was just about to go home. Hey, look, it's about Polly, Ned Hot Bop. I was thinking about the funding of the funeral. You see, I don't have enough money for the funeral, and maybe you can help me out on that. Anne, we already talked about this before. The funeral will not be going ahead. As you, why don't you, Dad, you don't care that Hot Bop and Polly don't even exist. That's not true. I never said that. Fire! You made my life go downhill ever since Hot Bob and Polly died, and because of your dodgy debt, you're not a help as Excuse me? Did you actually think I was responsible for ruining your life after what happened? Look, all I'm saying is that my credit card was declined. My husband and I share the same bank account, and Kai didn't pay his bills. Oh, right. So it turns out your own husband is ruining your life after all. Well, if you're poor, you might as well stay poor. I'm going to the funeral home and- Don't you dare use that language on me, young girl. I'm warning you. Or what? What are you gonna do about it, huh? Go on, hit me. I- Hey! What the hell is going on here? What's with the fighting? Ask her, fan. Ask her about what a lying bitch she is. Hello, Scott! Where are you? We need to talk. Scott's will? This video was part of G4P TV's Super Saturdays. Super Saturdays, the perfect way to kick off the weekend.